Hello, everybody. Hey, we all wear many business hats during the course of a day, but there's three hats we say you always wear. We'll see you in a few minutes. Our book about improving customer experiences is now in audiobook format on Amazon, Audible, and iTunes. Hello, everybody. Jeff Mason, your host of Simple Biz 360 podcast. Simplebiz360.com is our URL home. And our podcast is found on YouTube, IGTV, Gab TV, and 28 audio platforms. So today we're going to be talking about the three hats we don't want you to take off. And it centers around what we call the always factor. So let's take a look at the first hat. Always be servicing. It's a mindset. It's an attitude. It's a discipline. It's often void of customers saying thank you to us for doing it, uh, you know, but, but it's welcomed by customers in the same sense. They love when they get that always be serving, um, you know, mentality. It speaks volumes without ever saying any words right? Because it's action oriented. It builds trust. It comforts customers. It delivers. It shows character. Servicing delivers the intangibles. Oftentimes it's that attitude that, that really separates us from the pack in many cases. Always be developing is the second hat. It's a mindset. It's a discipline. It's an attitude. It builds skills. It becomes transferable. So you, you know, bottle up the skills with that transferable uh, notion, and now you can take them with you wherever you go. It's an investment. It elevates. It motivates. It creates. It fortifies. It polishes, and it pays the bills. Remember our episode with uh, Wes Cantrell, episode 158? All development is self-development, right? So what a great way to always remember that we're investing in ourselves. And then the third hat is always be observing, right? It teaches, it corrects, it reveals, it overlays. We can take something we've seen or observed and we can overlay it on our business. It inspires, it illuminates, it demonstrates, right? It captivates, it migrates, it actually can migrate over to other aspects of our business. And it substantiates us from the competition. In many cases, we get to learn what to do differently. So observations contain change agents. They really are the catalyst in many cases to getting us to scratch our heads and go, wow, what if I did the opposite of what I just observed, or what if I did what I just observed in my business, it might help me. So, so today we're going to uh, dip back for a lost in the shuffle track because that's all we've got on the three business tips in five minutes. Uh, but we're going to dip back to a song called "It's Going to Be All Right," and it's by Jerry and the Pacemakers, another Mersey beat sound coming out of that British invasion. Uh, what do they have in common with the Beatles? Well, they're from Liverpool. Brian Epstein managed the band as they did as he did the Beatles and uh, George Martin produced it uh, the songs and everything as they did for the Beatles so kind of cool so enjoy this tune and we will see you in 168 hours <laughs> 